Hi, my name is Colin. I'm 12 years old. I'm Matt. This is my wife, Amy. We're from Shoreview, Minnesota. Colin makes life interesting. <laughs> he's an old soul. He likes to dig in and find stuff out. And once he's into something, he'll research the heck out of it. And... He's funny and he's quirky. He's had to grow up fast. Um, and he's dealt with a lot of things that you know, other kids haven't had to, obviously. So in 2012, when he was three, he was diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia, AML. It wasn't expected. We went in literally at 9 o'clock thinking an ear infection, and by 1 o'clock we were... Being told he had leukemia. Leukemia. Children's was able to make that easier to navigate through. So in May of 2013, Colin finished up his treatment. Um, he had his regular checkups, and we were clear for, you know, seven years, seven, eight years. And then he... Um, over the last summer of 2020, he had some severe headaches, which nothing was, no medication was touching those headaches. Completely out of left field, we found out that it was a completely unrelated new cancer, the tumor in his pelvis. At the time, we thought, oh, I hope it's not AML again. And, you know, in hindsight, it's like, I wish it would have been AML again. <laughs> On September 8th, 2020, Colin was diagnosed with stage four Ewing sarcoma. And he's stage four because it had metastasized throughout his body. You kind of go through, you know, the normal, I mean, the, either for us, normal <laughs> stage of emotion since we've been through it before. I think I was probably more angry to begin with. I just, you know, because he had gone through so much the first time and so then to have to, you know, to know what he's going to have to go through again. You know, now he's older and he's going to know what he's... What he understands he's. more. My hopes and dreams is for Colin is that he can get back to his normal life, be with his friends, go on his bike rides, go to the beach, you know, enjoy his time with his family and his friends and live a long, long life. <laughs> he's got a really big bucket list, <laughs> so... We're on the hook for a lot, I think. But he's got a passion for life and he wants he wants to He wants to live it. He wants to live it.